Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the workshop here in gorgeous, beautiful Montana. It is not so bad to have a view like that right outside the workshop door. <laughs> I'm loving it, and this cold is really not quite as bad as I thought it would be. Admittedly, today's a warm day and the sun's out, but, I mean, it's been ridiculously cold. But, you know, you wrap up, you deal with it so far. Not so bad. The first thing on the agenda today is a friend of Will's and us. We're gonna be getting ready to put the rest of the stud work up onto the walls so that we can fill it with sound insulation to get rid of the echo inside of the shop. And so we need to jump right in. So now, with some great help, we have indeed stud work up here. We have stud work here, stud work there, as well as some of the insulation in that Will has just put in, but we're actually almost out of insulation. We've got some, uh, some thinner stuff, but we don't have enough of the 24 inch wide stuff to fill this up. So we need to make a run to buy some more sound insulation and buy some more of these painter's tops. I've been sorting out some computer work. Will, since then, has been in here in our wonderful little office here. Just pulling off all the painter's tape, putting the light ballasts back up onto the ceiling. How's it painting going, Will? Elf, the painting elf, that's me. Almost done. Yeah, there we go. That, that, was, that was bad, let's do it. Ow! That's cold! My hands are cold! I was just outside. But yeah, it's almost done in here, and it looks nice. The walls in here were brown, now they're white. This is gonna be a nice space to work in. Put some things up on the wall. But here's the question, are they too white? Should we go down a shade or two of white? I think they look good. I think I they look good. You want to repaint it? <laughs> I do not. You got, you got it, you started to enjoy it's painting? It's just a little joke I was doing. Oh, I thought you were enjoying your painting, Will. Well, you thought wrong. Here I was thinking I was giving you great tasks that you'd enjoy, but you know, there we go. Didn't even learn any karate at all. You didn't learn any karate. I know, the movies taught me wrong. I thought, you learn how to paint, you learn how to do karate. Hey, you know, I was just telling everybody, Will, we need more sound insulation. Yeah. And I was about to run this in to talking about how we need more sound insulation and we need to pick it up which means that we need a vehicle suitable for picking up the sound insulation. I think you're right. And you know how this goes, Will? This beautiful narrative now goes to the fact that hopefully today I can pick up my truck. Hopefully the money's cleared with them and I can pick up my truck. And that means that the next step on your karate learning journey, Will, is that truck could use some wax. Oh, wow, that is a wax on and wax off. I'm joking, oh we don't need to wax the truck, but we do need the truck, so hopefully today we're gonna be picking up that truck. This room looks awesome. But you can see when we go from that room to this room just how green these lights are. That is something else that we're gonna hope to deal with shortly, test out a load of LED tubes. But we'll be getting to that shortly. So one of the things we did yesterday is we went to a local steel supplier and we bought ourselves some steel. A piece of plate so we can have a little uh, simple welding table. This is in the dancing table? Uh, and we also got ourselves some 2x2 two two tube, a little bit of angle iron, these bits of steel right here. Are gonna be very useful for building some of the things that we need to build in here, such as benches. We're gonna build ourselves a simple little welding table with that piece of half inch plate. The jig table, the dancing table. And we're gonna use some of this tubing to build steel racks, build benches, all that fun stuff. However, you'll notice we don't have uh, 
We don't have outlets yet. Um, we've got beautiful 100 amps coming down here, and uh, hopefully it's today, right? Yeah, hopefully today the electrician's gonna be in and he's gonna be able to get three outlets down here for our Lincoln welders and the plasma cutter. And, 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 I just got news. 1 p.m., what's the time now? 10.57. In two hours and three minutes, I have an appointment to go pick up my pickup truck. Before we run into town and go and pick up the truck, we're gonna put up a flag right here. The Montana flag. So we got the flag up and it looks great from here until you do this and then you see that. We decided not to put canvas up behind it and just to put the flag straight up on the, uh, on the stud work and the sound insulation and you can see the studs through the flag where it's yellow and where obviously it's, you know, just a little bit more transparent. So that's a problem and we're gonna have to pick off the flag and restaple it up after we put some canvas down there. We can do that later. For now, we're gonna do a little run into town to drop off some stuff, pick some things up, buy some things, and do more errandy goodness. We got Will's car loaded up with cardboard, and we're about to dump some of this stuff off. It's cardboard when it's in the car, but when Alec has his truck, will it be called a trucked board? So it's, uh, it's one o'clock. It looks kind of like truck o'clock to me. Whoa! Hey -o. Oh, 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 I've got the keys. I'm putting them on my keychain. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, 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 here we go. This is pretty cool. This, this will make a British kid smile. It's like the size of me. Height, I mean, my truck at home is like this high. It's got a full foot on top of that here. This is a 2010 Ford F-150. It's red. Now I've got to learn how to drive on the right-hand side of the road. Finally. How am I going to do that? I have no idea, but... They, they have got insurance. And i got to get it back to the shop somehow, so we better, we better give it a go. This thing is ginormous! Oh my goodness. What is this gear shifter? It doesn't go side to side. Uh -oh. There are only three gears? Yep. <laughs> Let's go to the shop. Whoa, I'm moving! I've got an American truck! I'm driving an American pickup truck! This is insane! <laughs> this is cool. This is so cool. Oh, here we go. About to come into the shop. This is, uh... This is pretty awesome. I, I was just opening up to then go and help you unload, but it's fine. Since you got it all, do you mind just finishing off doing the key? I've got to go. Over it. Wait, hang on. I just need to. I just need to get through this door here. Oh. Will and I have made some big lists of things we need to get. Things that we need to get for the shop, and then also things that we need to get for my house because I signed the lease on a house just the other day. You know what? Maybe we could get Dunkin' Donuts as a sponsor since you like Dunkin' coffee on everything. Oh yeah, this. <laughs> This is in the truck, because we're taking it to the computer repair place. <laughs> I like the Dunkin' Donuts joke, Will. Thank you. We've got a list of things to do, errands to run. So we're going into town again, but this time, I'm driving. By the way, big shout out to Will for all your awesome help driving me around until it was that I got these. No I'm worries. so grateful, man. Test out the CD player with this lovely CD. From right. our good friend. So. so we're gonna play some of Ethan's music. Let's give it a go. Hey, Just, Ethan's yeah. gonna be stopping by soon, isn't he? He is indeed gonna be so stopping by soon. You guys, you guys are gonna meet him. Check him out, Ethan Hardy on Instagram. Ethan Hardy Blacksmith. Ethan Hardy Blacksmith. There we go. Let's go. Oh. Woo! This is cool. I like this. How do we park this? We're doing another lap. These spots are small. Found the right spot right here on the road where I can't crash into. Oh! I'm joking. We're good. Right, thanks Will. I've now got to go and uh, see if they can fix coffee. How long is it going to take? Two weeks. That's going to make life a little bit hard, but hopefully we'll at least be able to get the data off the hard drive. That means I'm now going to snip across on over to Home Depot. Got it all ratchet strapped down, Will? It's all relatively tight in there. Relatively tight? Yeah. Or like tight, tight. It's tight, tight. Okay. Time for me to go get me my house. Here we go. Got the house all sorted. I've got the key. There's the kitchen. It's a completely blank slate. So now it's time to go back to the Home Depot and buy some things for the house. We're back again. Oh, no, 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 no. The list. I think we forgot the list. Ha! You've got the list. Oh. Oh. Now we got to buy some stuff.
What a fantastic day. It's now like 9.30 at night. I am about to finally head home with the things that I need home that are here and I now have a home which is cool. So I'm gonna head off back that way but I just want to say I am so thrilled I have a compressor that will not need to start pumping every 10 seconds of blowing something down. I have this awesome tool drawer, little mobile workbench here thing which I'm very excited about. This is going to be useful. We've got quite a mess of tools here and then of course once my crate eventually arrives there's going to be more things to fill in that. I'm excited to soon be able to start fabricating. I'm excited to soon have all our sound insulation up. I'm excited to be bringing you along with it. And of course I'm excited for the red truck. I am just super duper excited about everything and I really hope that you're enjoying coming along with this. I can't wait to be making projects in here, getting some awesome things made. I really, really hope that you guys go to alexdealshop.com, grab yourself some of the Montana themed merch. A keen eye might spot a similarity between the colors of this and our Montana flag. We also have this awesome Steel Does Montana t-shirt. Be sure to check out the website. It is alexsteelshop.com. I need to put this back on because it's cold and this is oh so warm. I really appreciate your business. I really appreciate your viewership. So grateful. Can't wait to see you on the next episode. Bye-bye.